calling all flock members. If you want to become truly elite, for just a dollar a month, you too can become an elite bad bird. Check out my Patreon account. Link is in the description. Hey guys, it's Drew Drop again here, and today this is another uh, continuation. This is a continuation of the last video that I made, which is the Dragon Ball Z home video, uh, different versions of home video release of Dragon Ball Z, and what my personal best way to watch the series on DVD in the comfort of your own home. So, yes, that was Dragon Ball Z, but we all know there's a second part. And that's Dragon Ball GT. And I actually like GT. I think it's a cool story. I like it. I know a lot of people don't like it. And if you don't like it, then that's fine. But if you like it, like I do, I actually really like the series. But that's me. Uh, I think it's kind of underrated. But that's, that's just my opinion on it. But I'll probably make a separate video on GT later, on a later day. That's a different video. But anyways, this is a different home video ways of um, owning the series. So, I have... Uh, it's a very short series, so it's like only 60-some episodes. But, it is really uh, a good series for how it was, for me at least. I thought it was cool. So, yeah. Alright, so we're going to get with the first way to own the series. There's only I only have two ways here that you can own the series. Um, you have... Um, Dragon Ball, you have the Dragon Ball GT, uh, single DVDs, so, kind of the same thing as with the Dragon Ball Z DVDs, it's got a few episodes on it, kind of the same as, um, the, yeah, the other ones, but the thing is, is that there's no difference between this and the other version I'm getting ready to show you, but, you know, you get these little, these really cool covers like this, and it's uncut, it's got both the Japanese and the English on it. And it's got the English broadcast music and everything. So that's really cool. It's got the Step on the Grand Tour song, which is really cheesy and hilariously bad song. I still love it to this day. I eat it up every single day of the week. It's awesome. So yeah, I just love Dragon Ball GT. So yeah. So that is the... Uh, first way to own the things, and, and these are cheap too. There's only like two or three dollars per um, DVD, and it's only like there's only like a few because it's really short. So I highly suggest getting these if you want the uh, original English uh, broadcast, um, the original English broadcast stereo sound uh, score and in, in the background because it is different from the version I'm getting ready to show you right now. Which is Dragon Ball GT, the complete series box set on the Lime Bricks on DVD. So you got them here. Got this at Walmart for about 15 bucks. Super cheap. You get all episodes. All the episodes of Dragon Ball GT for about 15 bucks. Amazing deal. And I'm pretty sure these only have, yeah, these only have the Japanese music. So if you want the original uh, English music, you're going to have to get the, the single DVD. So, yes, but these, I, sw I swear the cover art, I still love the cover art on these. They look so good. Especially with Super Saiyan 4 Goku there. Uh, I think he looks really cool in this uh, picture. So, yeah. But yeah, it also contains the Dragon Ball GT movie on the bottom there. So you'll also get GT A Hero's Legacy on there as well. Uh, I think this is the best way, and I can pull these out for you guys to look. And oh yeah, it does still make a shelf thing, so you can line it up with your your Dragon Ball um, Z uh, things. And that's just so cool. Look at that. That's cool. That is cool. And on the first cover art, you have, again, Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Looks cool. Love the, the lime green part of these. I think it looks cool. 
you open it up here, you have all the discs laid out right here. So there you go. And then you have Season 2 with Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta on there. One of my favorite fight scenes all of Dragon Ball. So yeah. And then here's the inside of the, the, uh, the, the artwork and stuff. So yeah, it's awesome. I highly suggest you get this if you are a GT fan like me. Because I love GT. I love Dragon Ball GT. Some hearts, I, I hate to say this, but some hearts I actually like better than Super. I think GT is really cool. Um, and don't raise your pitchforks over that, guys. Because I actually love GT. And if you watched it and you don't like it, then that's fine. But still, I love it. But anyways, if you like it just like me... And you want the original uh, English broadcast score, then get this version. If you want all the episodes for an extremely cheap price, and you just kind of want them to have in your collection, like you might like them, but you really don't care, you just like, I want own all of it. Get these. Because it's worth it. Because I, I bought it at Walmart for $15, guys. That is a steal. $15 for anything Dragon Ball? Count me in, guys. Because I will get that. I will get that day one if they had, like, Dragon Ball Super, like, all the complete series on for $15. I would grab that in a heartbeat. Oh, man, that would be awesome. But anyways, that is it for GT today. Kind of shorter than the last episode because it is a shorter series. And it's not as confusing as Dragon Ball Z was. So, yeah. I'm going to let you guys go today again. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel, guys. Uh, like, Leave a like on this video. And uh, Drew drop out here today. And remember, the Bad Raven is your friend. And goodbye. <laughs>